guess where I am. I am at the bookstore. Of course. Again. As always. I'm never going to change. Hello, my little raindrops. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Desiree. It is so, so nice to have you here. As you can probably tell by the title of this video, as well as the fact that I am in my car. Today is a bookstore shopping video. Oh, I thought someone was behind my car. Okay. So, um, I actually did make a list. It is Desiree of the Past, and I am here to make a list of the books I would like to buy today. Excuse the washer in the background. We're just gonna, we're just gonna roll with it. Okay, piece of paper, pen. Let's write some books down. Okay, so I definitely want to buy Immortality by Dana Schwartz. If they have it, Ravel, because I'm reading this with a club on Fable. I also want Love in Focus 2, which is manga. True Beauty, the graphic novel, came out. I don't know when, but I, I just saw this on a bookstagrammer's post. They were in Target and it was there and I really want it. I don't know if they're gonna have it. I know there were more, but I can't remember, so... All right, back to the bookstore. So that I can try and follow it. Can I see how that goes? Yes, I am eating a plain Timbit, okay? Don't come at me. I really like them. It's nice and simple. But I'm just finishing up my lunch because I had a hair appointment and a nail appointment and it is 1.30 and I still hadn't eaten anything. So I just finished my lunch in the chapters parking lot. Love that for me. I have six books on this list, which either I will be able to find all of them and will buy all of them and buy a couple more, or I won't be able to find them, but I'll still manage to buy like 10 books regardless. Maybe that's a little bit extreme, but we shall see, we shall see. I want my window down. Oh, the sun is coming out. Ah, look at that, the sun is coming out. That's so fun. The last time I was here was a, a week ago. <laughs> oh my god. We're just gonna ignore that fact. Look, I got a sour cream Timbit. If you haven't tried the sour cream Timbit, what are you doing? Oh my god. It's so good. They're my absolute favorites. The goal of today's trip is obviously to try to get those books, but also to just have some fun. And like I always do, I'm going to move to recording with my phone because um, I don't want to bring my camera inside the store. We're just going to go with the phone. All right, let's go. Oh, the sun is out. Yay. I'm excited. Off we go. I'm so excited to read Ravel. I'm getting this because I just joined the Crow Club on Fable and this is the book they're reading in March. I'm so excited for it. It's like a caravel type of vibe thing based on Le Moulin Rouge in Paris. So I'm really excited for it. I don't know why they started doing that. Mm. What's that? Okay, let's go buy some manga. I saw this and now I want it. Every story needs a hero. Every story needs a villain. Every story needs a secret. Add to cart. They move things around again and I'm just so lost. Oh wait, there's a graphic novel in the youth section that I want to see if they have. to cart. Are you 
need to find love in focus. Where is it? I thought I saw it earlier. Where'd it go? I passed it. Killing stalking. Oh my god. They always have the second one, but not the first one. Does anyone remember reading this online? I sure do. That stuff is messed up. What? Oh, there it is. I just saw a spoiler. You know what I saw they have? I saw that they have like a collection or something. It's for your name. And I quite actually didn't <laughs> have it. Look, I have a tattoo for this, okay? See? It is one of my absolute favorite love stories of all time. And I want this. It is $40. I don't care. My wallet's gonna care afterwards, but it's fine. I feel like I already own all of the good books in the romance section, which is slightly concerning. <gasps> this, one of my favorite books of all time. Right after Small Favors, obviously. Ooh, wait, I want another Sally Rooney book. And I actually came here earlier and I saw they only had one left, so I hid it. I am so mean. The fact that I only bought this book because I know Harry Styles plays in the movie. I'm proud of it. It's so fun, I haven't actually taken the time to just browse aimlessly in the bookstore in so long. Loki, is that you? I don't know if I want it. Do I want it? Do I take it? Honestly, at this point, I'm just looking at the pretty covers. Where have I seen this before? I won't take it, but I do want it. Eventually. I feel like I have enough, but I don't know. Can I in here for like an hour. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> I'm, I'm cackling. This is too funny. So excuse the lighting. The sun is deciding to intrude our video, but I actually spent like 45 minutes an hour in chapters today, which I have not done this in such a long time. I usually come in here and I'm so rushed to just grab whatever I see and then get out. But today I, I made sure to take the rest of the day off and just browse. Like I haven't done that in such a long time and it felt so nice to do it. I, I actually, I've received a couple books from orders that I placed a little while ago. So I want to record a haul, including these once I get home. So I will just like, I'll quickly show you what I got, but I'll also record a haul, which I will probably post a week after this video but um anyways i got a notepad because i want to start carrying this everywhere i go why okay cool is that they wrote okay okay nice um i didn't really look but um I want to start carrying a notepad everywhere i go because i i have ideas throughout the day and i just I know I could use my notes app on my phone, but it's it's bugged. Like every single time I go on it, it freezes my phone for like 10 minutes. So I've stopped using it. So I decided to get this so that I can carry it everywhere I go so that I can write whatever thoughts I have throughout the day. Like it might be like a TikTok idea or a YouTube video idea or 
a thought for my job, for a blog post I want to write, or uh, we're out of something at home, let's write it down so I can remember it. Ouch, that hurt. I am going to have this in my bag with me everywhere I go. So that's nice. Next, for books, I got Ace of Spades because I am very in the like carnival-esque vibes and I felt like this would be good. And then I got Conversations with Friends by Sally Rooney. I just finished reading Normal People um, like last week and I am now obsessed with it. I would like to read all of her books. It's very, it's very unique. And one of the amazing girls I work with at Fable recommends this book to get out of a reading slump, which I'm not, I'm not in a slump, but I love the excuse to buy it. And then I got the entire collection of Love in Focus. It is like, it's only a three book manga series. I bought the first one and I finished reading it yesterday or the day before. It was either I buy the last two, which would have come up to like $34, or I buy the entire collection, which is $25. I bought the entire thing. And then True Beauty, the graphic novels are finally out. Back when I was in high school, Webtoon was my literal religion. I would actually take the time to wake up an hour before I needed to be up and just read on Webtoon. It was like, it was my morning routine. Wake up, go on Webtoon, read all the new uh, episodes that were up, and then start the day. And so when I saw that the first volume was out, when I tell you I ran. And then of course there is Ravel so excited to read this. As I mentioned, this is for a book club that I joined on Fable, the Crow Club, and uh, I actually have to write a blog post on this book. So I got it, we're gonna read it, and we're gonna read it quickly so that I can write that blog post. And then I found this book and I just, the cover stole my attention so quickly. It is Wink Poppy Midnight by April Genevieve Tocolke, I think. Just look how pretty. And basically it says, every story needs a hero, every story needs a villain, every story needs a secret. I was sold. And then, I actually have one of my followers that tagged me on this, but there's an official visual guide for your name. And they had it here. I didn't think they would have it, but they had it, and I bought it. It was $39, which, you know, it's pricey, but it is literally one of my absolute favorite movies of all time. But I'm so glad I bought this. And now I have to rush to the grocery store before I go back to my apartment. Um, my, my boyfriend is going away for a week-long training and I'm going back home so tonight is kind of date night so I want to go to the grocery store and grab a couple things. I'm also incredibly thirsty and I forgot to bring my water bottle so I'm gonna go buy a water bottle. But I hope you enjoyed this very all over the place vlog. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for taking some time in your day to watch my content. If you liked it, make sure to leave a thumbs up. It is a great way to support. And if you'd like to join the Little Raindrops family, click the subscribe button and make sure to have the notification bell on to know whenever I post new stuff. I shall get going. Thank you again for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.